Hey guys, Clutch Corner here. We're gonna be diving into a Beastie Pops Funko Pop mystery box. There's two inside, it's a $70 box and it's $100 guaranteed. So I paid 140, guaranteed 200. Um, this is the box. Now I'm not sure if two are just thrown in here. They're gonna be separate boxed. Um, but there are two boxes. If they are separate box, I'm gonna do two different videos. Um, if it is just the one, we got two mystery boxes here. So we're just gonna dive right into it. $70 cost, $100 guaranteed. I think it's four pops per box, so it could be eight. anything guys it's all bubble wrapped up so we're just gonna very well packaged these are each individual pops i'm gonna get them all out we're gonna do both of them just because they are all open Maybe it was two to, yeah, that's all of them. Yeah, that's all of them. So maybe it was two to four. It looks like one got three, one got four. Um, I'll have to double check and let you know, but. Yeah, so I'm not sure which one it is, but, or which one's which. So we're just looking for $200 value in total. You can dive right into them. Um, as far as I, I can't really tell if they're in a soft protector, hard protector. Um, so as far as values, maybe we might hit the top one first. We might hit the top one last. Might be in the middle. Uh, this one's in a soft protector, but a lot of people do mystery boxes, put everything in soft protectors. So that might just be something he does. But looks like we got Spider Man, and this is from. Web World Engineering Brigade. So that's the one with him and Iron Man. That's the that's the set right there. This is a doesn't have the year on the bottom. So it must be kind of newer. The newer ones don't have the year on the bottom. Spider Man. Be a lot of bull wrap. And this one's also in a soft stretcher. So that's probably something he does. Um, it's just a local one I found on Instagram. It's Beastie Pops. Um, I think it's Beastie Pops Mystery Box on Instagram. If you guys are interested. This one is, says Trick or Treat Sam. I'm not sure the value on this one, but I do really like this pop. Hot Topic exclusive Sam. That's pretty cool. This one is... Uh, no year on the bottom on this one either. Trying to see if I can like read something that just says the year of it, but yeah, I'm not seeing anything. But yeah, Sam, I do like this pop quite a bit. It's just him holding the lollipop, but it's pretty cool. Um, I don't think it's worth that much, so I think we're still still waiting on a little bit of value here. Uh, I really have no idea on the Spider-Man, but I'm guessing it's kind of newer. I could be completely wrong. So yeah, on this channel, guys, we're gonna. We're going to unbox, look, open. We're going to find everything. You collect it, we find it. PlayStation Medieval Sir Daniel Fortesque. This is a GameStop exclusive. So like on the bottom here, right there, you guys can see. That's what I was looking for. It's 10 October 2022. So that's what I was looking for. So this is a pretty recent pop. I don't think I, yeah. And that's not the same, so yeah. Well, this one's cool. Um, I'm gonna guess it's probably 10 bucks, 15 bucks. Um, I don't think the pops, like like the GameStop pops, the Hot Topic pops, like things like that, they don't, the, not the GameStop, the PlayStation, the Hot Topic, like offset games that like the company can control, they just mass produce. 
so I don't think there's a lot of value in that one. Jeez, packing's pretty good. All right, so I can see Dragon Ball Z. Jackie Chung, 2021 Spring Convention Limited Edition. Jackie Chung, that's pretty good. Um, from what I can tell, it pops in good condition. But yeah, that's pretty... I, same thing with Dragon Ball, a lot of these pops are mass-produced. There are a couple that are really good. Um, I don't think this is one of it, but I'm not sure. The convention, that's going to play a big part into it. But yeah, Jackie Chung. So we got three left. Um, the only one that I think is worth some is that Jackie Chung, but I could be wrong. Like I said, I'm just going off the stickers. The Sam, I don't. I think last time I saw it, it wasn't worth much. We're looking for 200 bucks here. Gosh, can't open Oh, I see Freddy. Freddy Funko. It says Teen Wolf on the back. Yep. Freddy Funko. Box of fun. 3,000 piece exclusive Teen Wolf. I'm going to say this is going to be our big one. 3,000 piece. That's pretty limited. Um, anything Freddy Funko. People collect the Freddies. So that's pretty good. Um, and I think this is, it looks like a 2021 Bob. So, that's pretty good. I'm going to say that's our best hit right now. Um, and I think that was the pop. That was the technically the box with three. Uh, it was on top. So, if that one's really worth it, these ones probably aren't going to be worth the value. If that one's like 80, 90, 100 bucks, it could be more. We're going to check prices at the end. Cruz Ramirez. Dynaco. From Cars. I guess say Cars is probably my favorite Disney movie. I don't know why. Just really like Cars. Yep, Cruise, Dynaco. And these ones are cool because they're the same size, but it's tilted. So they sit like a car. They're not like, like a normal pop. I think that's just a cool thing they thought of. Like a lot of people wouldn't have thought of that. And you think of it now and you're like, oh, that's obvious. Like sit like a car, but... Companies don't always pay attention to that obvious detail. Uh, this one looks like maybe another Dragon Ball. Dragon Ball Z Karen? Karen? Funimation 2021 exclusive flocked. So that's pretty good. 2021, obviously. Um, but if it is the actual exclusive, it's going to be faulted and only limited to that, um, whatever, Funimation. I've never seen, I've never seen Dragon Ball Z, but like a lot of the characters, you know, I've never heard of Karen, Karan. Yeah, I don't know. But that's going to be all our pops. Uh, we're going to go ahead and check the values and let you guys know how we did. All right. So we're going to run through these prices. Dead off the, the memory, so we might be a little, a little off on some of these. This one came back at 15. Cruz Ramirez, it's pretty cool. Nice little pop there. This one was 32, so this is the actual sticker from that con. Um, but $32 isn't much for a con pop. And then Freddy Funko was actually 42, or 47. 47, 32, and 15. So it came up like six dollars short of 100 which i mean you only paid 70 so i'm not really complaining this is a cool one though i think you might be able to get a little bit more maybe in that 50 range but yeah three thousand piece exclusive you're gonna be able to sell that for it um so that one came to i think it came to 94 if you did all the math this one was actually pretty surprising 16 um i would have figured like 8 10 might as well throw it away but 16 not too bad Jackie Chung was at 23, so that's pretty good. Um, it is the shared sticker, so it's not the actual con sticker. Um, and it's not vaulted, so they could print more, but typically with those, they do a certain amount to the 
So like the Count Sticker Prince one, they do two shared stickers per that one, something like that. Sam, um, like I said, it's not too much. It's a $20 pop, which was more than I thought, but it's not like a huge one. Uh, but I think it's just a cool one. But yeah, 20, so we got 16, 23, that's 39 plus 20. So you're at 59. So you make up $41. And this one is, this one's actually $65. I was not expecting that. Typically Spider-Man stuff, um, Avenger stuff, like they mass produce them because people, you don't have to be a fan of Funko to collect Avengers or Harry Potter or Star Wars or Dragon Ball Z. So those kinds of things they mass produce. But yeah, sixty five dollars. That one's pretty good. Um, I don't know. I don't know if it's any land on anything coming up or they're expecting. So price might be like elevated right now, but. $65, I'm going to try to get that sold. Um, the only thing I would think about keeping is this Funko Pop right here. I probably will. Uh, but everything else I'm going to get rid of. This one being the big one. So, yeah, that totals us up to, let me see, what we have? 94 plus, probably should have done this ahead of time. We have 50, 59 plus 65, 1, 119 plus 5, 124 on top of 94. So, 218 not too bad 218 only paid 140 uh that's 140 flat shipping included 140 so yes 70 dollar gain 80 dollar gain almost that's pretty good uh in my eyes as far as the mystery box you are not guaranteed anything so as far as making 80 bucks that's pretty good you might get stuff that you can't sell so like it says guarantee value but let's say you get 10 10 dollar pops and they're just mass produced. You can't sell them. Did you really get a good value there? Even though it's a hundred dollars, that's kind of what you got to look at. But yeah, I'd say we got pretty good value here. We're going to be able to sell a lot of these and that's what's important. So yeah, $65 on that one. And that's all I got for you guys till next time. See you.